It's the 2nd of April, 2017, and I've already done some things this morning. Went to town with the parents, um, got some breakfast, got some groceries, and now we're back home. After said groceries are put up, then it is time to do gig. Well, after some reading, then it's time to do gig. I also found out a friend of mine is breaking up with Snapchat, so to speak. Oh well. We have another person leaving the kingdom. However, I wonder what that person's doing with their spectacles. Hmm, maybe I need to send an email. We finished gig. Pretty good gig, as usual. Um, now, after watching a behind-the-scenes of a movie that I helped fund, really looking forward to it. As it gets closer, I'll tell you guys about it. Um, and now, I'm going to play some more Mass Effect, because it's time to land on the second planet. So I've just been having a relaxed evening, but um, I watched another episode of Black Mirror because I knew I could stand it. Oh dear. This one was called Playtest, I believe was the name of it. It was the one that Dan Tra Trachtenberg did, which made me happy. I'm just loving this whole uh, podcasters that do something big thing that I've had for this weekend. Because first it was C. Robert Cargill that I used to listen to in the Spill days. Um, you know, before Hollywood.com pulled the rug. And him writing the Doctor Strange script. And now Dan Trachtenberg directing a bunch of things, including that episode. But anyway, Trachtenberg directing, that made me happy. Which is good, because that one affected me a whole lot more than I was expecting. Because, frankly, um, usually when you finish an episode of Black Mirror, it leaves you a bit on we, right? You kind of feel, <sighs> afterwards. But this one genuinely screwed with me. Um, and it wasn't because it hit home personally, per se. I guess without spoiling anything, the main theme was that, at least in my opinion, a guy, well, he wasn't appreciating having a mother. And it ended up biting him in the end. And that's, that's all I'll say about it. But you need to know that for the context. It... It sort of stabbed me. I'm not I'm not entirely sure why it did the way it did, but oh, yeah, it did. Maybe it's because I make sure to appreciate that I have the parents I have. That my parents, I, I love them to pieces and the idea of losing them. <sighs> Especially considering I had a personal friend that, well, frankly isn't that lucky and lost a parent early, so... So because of that friend even more, I realize how much I love my parents and want to keep hold of them. You know. So that one legitimately I had to go down the hill and hug mom. It was it was a legitimate I needed to do it. Which of course her response after that was, You sure you need to be watching Black Mirror? She she says this every single time and I watch an episode of that show. I wanna make it through it. Uh, my friend Donovan stopped it because he found it boring, which I don't know how the heck that is a thing. Not saying anything bad about my friend at all, obviously. He'll, he'll laugh his head off if he sees this, but it's, it's like, really? Boring is your word? <laughs> but to me, I, I debate it because of the way it makes me feel afterwards. Mind you, it makes you think deep, right? And the making you think deep is part of the whole kind of... I hate to use the word, but message of the whole show, right? But hitting me that hard. Don't know. That one was a bit rough.